I'm really glad I get to go back to work tomorrow. Even though I want a lot more time off and don't really feel like I got much of a vacation, I'm really glad that I'm going back to work. Because right now, in reviewing the last two weeks of my vlog, it just feels like my entire day is sitting in my nerd box and going to the store. Today is a weird day in our house. Um, several years ago, uh, on this date, Gerilyn's dad took his own life, and so it's always a very emotional day for us. Surprisingly, Gerilyn's the one who's handling it the best. The rest of us are just kind of losing our minds. We're not, we're not doing very well. We have no idea why he did it. We're never gonna know he didn't leave a note or anything. But what I can tell you is that it caused us an immense amount of anguish and pain. And it still causes us anguish and pain. It's just awful. So on this day, Gerilyn always makes snickerdoodles, which were her dad's favorite. I always drink coffee out of a coffee cup and put a spoon in it, because that's what her dad would do, and it would drive Gerilyn's stepmom nuts, because he'd leave spoons all around the house and nobody could find them. Just little tiny ways of remembering him. Suicide is a horrible thing. It's devastating. And we had such a hard time explaining it to our boys. All we could say is that there was something wrong in Grandpa's head. That's all we could say. But uh, I mean, we'll never know. But I always wonder what was so bad that taking his life was better than staying alive. I, I can't even conceive of that. My, I mean, my life is great. I can't even conceive of that. I can't even conceive of what it would mean to wake up one day and decide it's better to not be here than to be here. And I don't know what was in his head, but here's what I do know. I hate it when people say that people who commit suicide are cowards. You have, you have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. And that is a horrible thing to say. So if you know someone who has had someone that they love or someone that they're close to and they've committed suicide, don't you ever dare damn say people who commit suicide are cowards. That is just about one of the most callous things you can ever say to anyone. I mean, just think of the horror that they must have been experiencing. To think that not being alive was better than being alive. I'm pretty raw and emotional and my whole family seems to be pretty raw and emotional. I'm sure 
Jerry Allen will feel it at some point today. But I'm gonna put a link to the suicide prevention hotline down in the doobly-doo. If you're at a place where you are thinking about harming yourself, um, call the number down below. If for no other reason than to not leave people like me and my family, try to pick up the pieces and move on because it's a horrible, horrible thing even years later. So, Christmas vacation ends today. Work starts again tomorrow. Life goes back to normal. This blog will return to its regularly scheduled programming. Be good to yourself, be good to each other.